All right, let's do it, man. Y'all already know what time it is. The Lakers beat down the Heat. Game one of the NBA Finals. Anthony Davis led the team with 34 points. LeBron had 25 points. 34 and 25. They killed the the Heat. So basically in the first the first quarter, the Heat were actually up. They were up by 13. Uh, Jimmy Butler came out aggressive. He did have 23 points. I'll get to why he slowed down after his first 16 points or whatnot. But basically uh, after the first quarter, the Lakers bench took over slash role players, basically. Uh, they just started hitting a bunch of threes. They made 11 threes in the first half, uh, the Lakers did. KCP and Danny Green was making threes. Uh, <clears throat> Caruso contributed. Dwight Howard did his thing on the defensive end. But AD and LeBron was killing uh, the Heat. And this was from basically uh, second quarter to fourth quarter. They was killing them. The only time the Lakers let off on the pedal was the fourth quarter, like middle of the fourth quarter. That's because they were beating them up like really bad. <sighs> My bad. Pardon me. But uh, yeah. So the Lakers, they were just beating them up bad. So basically, this is what happened throughout the quarters. Uh, Goran Dragic, he got an injury. I think his foot or something like that. Uh, Bam Adebayo, he got an injury. Uh, I think it was his elbow or his arm. And then Jimmy Butler twisted his ankle trying to make a move on AD. So there goes your issue right there. Tyler Hero, we stopped him from going crazy. Uh, yeah, and then uh, Duncan Robinson, he didn't go too crazy neither. So the Lakers did as well as you would want them to do from the defensive end. Uh, man, great, great game. And you know what LeBron's record in game ones of NBA Finals. He played as if his record was like a winning record or something. <laughs> yeah, but um, yeah, Lakers dominated... Uh, Three-point line, free throws, and rebounds. We dominated those categories, period. So, I was really excited to see them play like this. Just amazing. Now, I did think that LeBron, and look, this is still early. Um, I felt, okay, so originally I, I, I thought before uh, the series with the Nuggets ended, I thought, okay, maybe AD will win the finals MVP, but then I changed my pick to LeBron because his rebounds were down. Like he was scoring, but the rebounds were down. I like used like the last two games. I think he only was getting like between five to six rebounds, but in this game, he upped it and he had 34 points. So if he's averaging 34 points and let's say he averages between nine to 10 rebounds, I think even with uh, LeBron being the stat stuffer that he is, I, I still think that AD could win this finals MVP. Um, I also had the Lakers winning in six. We'll see what happens with this series, but I really do believe now that the Lakers can win in four, given the circumstances that and the situation that we've seen in game one. So, yeah, that's my take. Uh, Lakers played awesome offensively, defensively. The energy, the intensity was high. I love it. Uh, yeah, man. Give me your thoughts on uh, who you think is going to win game two. Uh, give me your, your thoughts on who you think is going to win this series. Give me your thoughts on who you think is going to be Finals MVP. Uh, man, just give me all your comments and your thoughts down below.